Sam, help out with sensors. Hard to believe the Lucinia could survive in all this. It's going to be all right. I... It will. Thanks. Sarissa will have plans for those decimation hunters. Wrote the manual on crisis situations. The commando you mentioned. You still believe she'll save the day? Sarissa was a legend even before she was the Pathfinder's bodyguard. She'll have a plan. Aha! Detecting an initiative vessel. Reading life signs and minimal power, multiple hull breaches. She's a wreck. If she's spaceworthy and her crew's alive, that's all we need. Callow, take us in. I'll try. Must be one docking bay still holding together. To comms? Nothing. Maybe their sensors are busted. <laughs> what a mess. No space battle did this. They had borders. Hello? Anyone? We're here to help. We should bro Beginning decompression. Die, you cat monsters. We're not cat, we're a Pathfinder team. Ryder, Lieutenant Harper, and uh, Sam, just send her our agent codes. Confirmed. Sorry. I'm Captain Atondra of what's left of the Lucinia. Come up to the bridge. Maybe you can help fix this mess. Okay, I'd be tense too, but that was close. This area saw combat action. No bodies, though. Whatever happened left the captain a little trigger happy. If the Tempest looked like this, how would you feel? But you'd vent a Pathfinder team into space? Respectfully, yes. We can't take any more chances. <clears throat> Sarissa Theris, Pathfinder. Don't mind the captain. Scolding me eases her blood pressure. Cora here thought the famous Sarissa would have everything in hand. I thought Matriarch Ashara was Pathfinder, ma'am, and you were her bodyguard, like her Tiamna. I served with the Sari Commandos, ma'am. Memorized all your battle manuals. Matriarch Ashara is dead. Sarissa was next in line. Her battle manuals haven't kept the cat off my arc. That ends today. We'll see your arc safely back to the Nexus. I hope so. We've tried everything else. Matriarch Ashara died trying to negotiate with those cat bastards, so I took something precious from them, too. I stole a module containing tactical data, all their secret routes through this phenomenon. We call it the Scourge, ma'am. If we could outmaneuver the Ket through it... We'd stand a better chance against them. Their Archon had the same thought. He sent his elite agent, the Valiant, and his decimation hunters after us. We take more damage each time we escape the Valiant. The last assault? He sent forces to board us. Sarissa's theft has made things... problematic. You pissed off the Ket and endangered your Ark for a map? Nice. Ryder! Well, I've only been running military ops since your ancestors were children. But here we are. What would it take to get the Ark out of here before this Valiant catches up again? An FTL burn long enough to lose him. But since the evacuation, we've been stuck at minimal power. The drive core is dead. My people are investigating, but those systems are below deck, with the Ket borders. Another Pathfinder team could back them up. Get power for the drive core. And my Sam and I will finish deciphering the Ket data. We'll turn the Valiant's escape routes against him. 
Consider it done, ma'am. The last commando report came from hangar control. I'll give you access. Please be careful. Okay, Cora? A little harsh, Ryder, what you said about the data. The Lucinia is alone out here. Sarissa needed every advantage. Maybe it needed to be said. Let's just get this done. Was it this quiet when the Arcs were traveling through dark space? <laughs> That's a cheery thought. The Lucinia will be back to normal once we get her to the Nexus. Here we are. Hangar control. There, a commando. Must be part of Sarissa's team. Stop! In the name of the goddess, I'll... Shoot your rescuers. Rescuers? And humans? Your Ark made it? Just about. I'm Ryder, the Human Pathfinder. This is my team. I'm Vidaria Damali, Sarissa's new second-in-command. Sorry about the mix-up. I hope I can help. The captain says we need to restore power to go to FTL. Right, yes. I've tracked the power drain, and I think shutting the hangar bay doors will fix it. The cat forced the doors open, and the safeties are draining power trying to shut them. Don't worry. My Sam can probably override whatever the cat did. Cat can survive in vacuum for a little while. If we shut the doors, the Valiant's pet hunters lose their last escape route, too. I pray the power will be enough for FTL. I just... Vidaria, I served as a huntress. Remember Sarissa's manuals. Breathe, purpose, action. Breathe. <sighs> okay. Please take a look at the console. I'll keep watch. Starting hangar door closure sequence. Kent! We've got this. Cover the console while Sam works. Nice, steady fire. Yes, ma'am. And the door closure at 21%. are closed and locked. Cat access is cut off. Okay, that should have done it. Seems pretty dark for having the power back on. Vidaria? Let's ask her. 
What was that? I estimate that several of the arc's electrical junctions just overloaded. Shit! Vidaria? Vidaria's down by that maintenance panel. Vidaria, Sam says we lost some electrical junctions. I know. The overload started a fire. Damn it, that shouldn't have happened. Be calm, soldier. What could have made him overload? If... If there's something else draining power on the lower decks, as something big... Theories can wait, people. Let's secure the Ark first. That might be complicated. Those Ket... They must be watching us. If they delay the repairs long enough, the Valiant ship catches up. Can we flash some lights, make some noise, get the kid off our backs? Well, splitting up would give them two targets, right? Okay. First thing is the last stasis pods. I'll go check on them. You could go below, look for whatever's draining power, and maybe help with the fire. Which way to the lower decks? Uh, the living quarters. I'll open maintenance access. You can cut through. Good luck. May the cat wither in the void before you.